In this interesting question, given is a rectangle with this point as midpoint of the side length, these two angles are equal. With the given dimensions, we have to find the area of rectangle. Let's check the solution. From point E, let's draw a perpendicular on AF. Now let's have a look at triangle ABE and triangle AGE. Both have got angle alpha 90 degree and side 9 centimeter. Thus by angle angle side, both the triangles are congruent and thus the corresponding sides are equal or we can say that EG is equals to EB. <coughs> so this length is also equal to this length. And also this angle here, this is 90 minus alpha and this angle here will be 90 minus alpha. Let's join EF. Now if you look at the triangle FGE and triangle FCE. Now in these two triangles, they have got 90 degree angle. They have got equal sides are there and they have got same hypotenuse. Thus by RHS, that's right angle hypotenuse and side, both the triangles are congruent to each other. As the triangles are congruent, thus corresponding angles will be equal. But if you look at this angle, this is 180 minus 2 alpha. So these two angles combined will be 2 alpha or each angle will be alpha degrees. <clears throat> and this angle here, that's 90 minus alpha plus alpha. So this angle will be 90 degrees. Now let's remove every extra information here and let's concentrate on triangle ABE and triangle AEF. Both the triangles have got angle alpha and 90 degrees. Thus by AA similarity, both the triangles are similar to each other. As the triangles are similar, thus the ratio of corresponding sides will be equal. So that is AB upon AE will be equal to AE upon AF. <coughs> Putting the values here, AB is what we have to find. AE is 9 centimeter and AF is 10 centimeter. So putting these values, cross multiplying it, we'll get AB as 8.1 centimeter. That's the length of the rectangle. What we are interested now is the breadth of rectangle to get the area. And for breadth, we'll first find BE by applying Pythagoras theorem in triangle ABE. So by applying Pythagoras theorem and solving it, we'll get BE as 3.92 centimeter. And twice of it is what will give me the breadth of the rectangle. And length times breadth is what will give me the area of rectangle. On multiplying it, we'll get our area as 63.5 centimeter square. And that's our answer. I hope you enjoyed the solution. I will see you in next video. Till then, tata, bye bye.